okay good day friends i would like to show us how to draw a survey plan in autocad so let's begin first i would love to show you a sample let's see i have one here and from one of my clients so you can see we have the distance and the degree at which they all intersect so let me get an autocad file for us to practice with um, sorry let me see um, I have one here okay you can see an um, example here very very irregular site but with the survey plan we get that right so firstly to get that we click our line then on the screen we just click anywhere then come to survey plan and let's start with this distance that would be 5590 meters and just hold down the shift button and the two button number two button then in here we are going to type in 5590 then to get to the degree hold down the shift button and the lesser than button that's the button beside the alphabet M then requires us to now type in the degree to 64 degree then 264 then enter see never mind where the button is taking you to just continue like that again we are going to input 24 meters okay <coughs> then go the shift button and the number two button then input the 24,000 mm then hold the shift button and lesser than button again then input the degrees that's 219 degrees one nine enter i think we are going somewhere then you come there again move to the next one which is 26 meters that to be 26,000 millimeters hold down the shift button and the art button now type in 26000 then hold down the shift button and less than button that's lesser than then we import the degrees which is 129 degrees 1, 2, 9 enter we are going somewhere again put down the shift button and the act button again and come here we have 27.99 meters that's 27990 and go down the shift button and lesser than button on here and we are inputting 39 degrees that's 39 degrees almost done well uh, a real architect shouldn't just join like this zone so 22.05 meters that's hold on the shift and add button then input 22.050 um, then hold on the shift and lesser than button for us to input degree that's 309 degrees then we can input that and press enter. Um, 
same thing we are done if you want to check you can check for us to be sure Okay, we check here we have 24. Here we have 24. Check here we have 26. And we have that's 26. Here we have 27.99. 27. Here we have 22. We have 22 here. So we want it to just be this this shape. So we just have to rotate that. The rotate button. Believe now we are having it the way it should be yeah I think that's all well thank you for watching let's see thank you for watching